success we always have this idea in our head what success looks like even when we're younger we have this idea of what we are going to look like at our mid-30s our 20s our 40s our 50s our 60s and what success is unfortunately sometimes with life and a lot of different things um it doesn't go exactly as planned Sometimes we hit success very early on in life and we kind of live our glory days then. And then after that happens, we don't know what to do. We kind of live in the past of our glory days and how it used to be and not realizing that it's no longer here anymore. It's a very difficult thing to go through mentally, physically, uh, gets in your head the negativity maybe you work for an amazing company and leave and then find out how hard it actually is on the other side we then resent some other people causes some hatred which is always a negative and we blame everything on everybody else on why you're not successful anymore and maybe it's not that you're not successful but you don't feel like you're part of something something bigger than yourself and so then you become lost in what you used to have it's very difficult we kind of start to judge what we did maybe it was a mistake and maybe it was a mistake maybe it wasn't maybe you've actually gotten better um, maybe you've actually learned a lot um, that's actually going to further yourself in your career and so you get lost um, and all these different things going through your head, which then causes you to be kind of shocked into not moving, not doing anything, which is probably the worst thing that you possibly can do. And so it's very difficult to live in the past. You guys obviously can't, because um, those who do um, never see success afterwards. It was a very difficult thing for myself, um, leaving an extremely successful dealership um, to go further in my career and, and kind of got you know, smacked in the mouth a few times. Um, found out how bad a, a culture could be, um, was turned negative in, in a lot of aspects and, and started hating um, kind of what I was becoming in a way. Um, and it wasn't until I really took full responsibility and, and was like, all right, if I don't like this place, then leave. Um, and that's what I did. Um, luckily, I had a friend in the industry that was looking. And now I've, I'm part of something. I'm part of a, a great culture. I'm part of a great uh, plan um, to take a, a dealership to the next level, to change lives, which is huge. But for me, I had a tough time living, trying to get out of my own head. It's very simple to, it's very easy to, to get in your own head and play the whole poor, pitiful me, you know, the whole fuck it attitude. And, you know, that if I just could, if I didn't, but then if I didn't, then I wouldn't have been able to be where I am today. I wouldn't have made those struggles financially I didn't make any struggles financially I'm, I'm actually better off but my head kind of threw me off um, I was no longer part of that I was what part of that that built it I was you know I had that pride that I, I helped build something that has changed lives and continues to change lives um, I was hit up by someone that I worked with there and, and was talking about how you know, if it, they thank me for pushing them. Thank me for not letting them um, live in their home bullshit. And you know, that's something that that hits hard in my heart. I mean, it just hits. It's right there. It's what I'm here for. It's what I want to do. I want to change lives. I want to impact lives. I want people to come to my funeral. I want to build that legacy. But here recently, I had to get out of my own head because I worked for a dealership that was extremely negative and it turned me negative. It was a very difficult thing for me to get out of. 
And so if you're in that area, I mean, I, I get it. I've been there. It's tough. But if you're living in the past, if you're living for what used to be, it's not what it used to be. And so you have to live with that and you have to push forward because you can't move forward always looking backwards. And so if you have gone through this, you're going through this, maybe you will go through this and you've listened to this podcast, just remember, you can't go forward looking backwards. 